What brings you out here today? Uh, pride in my community and in my company. And so you are you work for Alphabet or Google? Yes. yes. Google? Yeah. So did this, um, was this something that the company was putting on or you guys just decided to do? We, we all uh, organized together and it's, it's com but the comp company organized it, yeah. The company did. So have you heard about the uh, straight pride parade that people are organizing in August? Yes, unfortunately. Would you guys go to that and stand by them as allies? Definitely not this group. Um, I, different, different employees organize different things, but it's not something that the company would, organ, would support, I don't believe. You don't think the company would support the straight pride parade? I don't believe so. Was it, isn't it good to be inclusive to everyone? I mean, yes, but that, that, the, the uh, organizers of that group don't seem to be inclusive, do they? The organizers of what? Of that group don't seem to be inclusive, do they? Brian. Well, I don't know. I'm just asking, like, what are Google's policies, you know? Google is inclusive of everyone. Of everyone? But you think they wouldn't go to the straight pride parade? Like I said, different different employees can do whatever, do, can join different organizations. Like, this is a group of employees that uh, all, want, all want to be here, and that's different employees have different opinions. What do you guys think about conservatives being banned on YouTube and Google platforms for hate speech? Everyone here is speaking as themselves, not as the company. Yes. Nobody here is a spokesman for Google, and I want to make that extremely clear. So we are encouraged as individuals to attend here, but any the, anything anybody here is speaking of is as a sole employee. I just want to make sure that's clear. Yes, people understand. Okay, thank you. What do you guys think about how Google's cracking down on hate speech on the internet? I'm unaware of it, so I can't answer that. <laughs> I've looked into it a little bit, um, done some research on it, and I think while free speech is one of the most important rights in America, and obviously we have to protect it, there comes a time when it goes from expressing an unpopular opinion to riling people up and potentially causing actual altercations to occur, and I think that's a hard line to find, and I think that's what um, Google should be at least trying to find right now, um, but it is important to protect our freedom of speech. Should there be allowed to be any criticism of the LGBTQ community? Absolutely. Just because you're in the LGBTQ community does not mean you're a good person. It's a part of your identity, and for a lot of us it's an important part of our identity because of what um, those before us have had to go through to earn certain rights. But I know tons of people in our community that I, I don't like as people. And it, I mean, if someone's, uh, you know, a figure in our community, but they're not, you know, acting how they should be, I think it's perfectly acceptable to call them out. Info War. The most banned network in the world. When it comes to rebuilding your energy, convenience is key. While coffee, candy, and other sugary products can give you a short boost, the crash can leave you more tired than ever. Turbo Force from InfoWars Life is a powerful mix-in energy packet that utilizes vitamins, amino acids, and extracts used for hundreds of years to provide you focus, clarity, and a boost of energy on the go. Simply take a packet, mix it into the indicated amount of water, and enjoy. With 14 servings per box for a two-week or more supply, this is the formula to stock up on whenever you need a boost. Perfect for work, in the car, or at home. Turbo Force is the ultimate answer to a sluggish day. Don't let your day slow you down. Perk up with Turbo Force at InfoWarsStore.com.